We bout to play 2K Brutal Sim, step back J Kobe got that clutch, throw it up That's game, I'm going through the lane Russell Westbrook, quickness What up, what up It's your boy You don't know Brutal Sim on the scene Wicked and mean with some more info for y'all, man You know your boy gotta keep y'all updated, man you already know man so shout out man I right, yo shout out to my subscribers y'all y'all be keeping your boy up on the game man today today all right y'all sent me that screenshot man you sent me that screenshot tell me about the dev answering questions man so you know how you know how we do it man it's a transfer of information man sometimes some stuff gonna slip through my fingers y'all gonna hit your boy up and I'm gonna get it y'all gonna say yo man did you see this I'll be like nah man then I'm gonna get it back to y'all, man. Y'all know how we do it over here, man. So let's get straight to it, man. Now, a dev was answering some questions, y'all. And he gave us some pretty interesting information. Some pretty interesting information. And we're gonna get straight to it. We, we, we already stole long enough, man, right? Now, he said there are a total of 100 and 89 different archetypes to choose from when you consider pures hybrids and the five standard positions man 189 different combinations bro that's crazy man that's hella crazy and he's talking about the five position you know what's the five position man one two three four five the point guard shooting guard uh small forward power forward and the center man all right so yeah, a hundred and because everyone asking how much different archetypes. What well, you, you see the combinations? You could you see the combination, man? A hundred and eighty nine different archetypes. <laughs> That's crazy, man. All right. Now he went on to say, now this is where he's talking about the changes we could expect in two K eighteen gameplay, right? He talked. He uh, spoke about the post game. He said many upgrades this year can choose your pivot facing while holding the ball can dominate mismatches way better than last year right so like i expected this is something i expected though especially looking at shaq as a cover athlete and shaq was really dominant in terms of overpowering people but people don't give Shaq enough props for being skilled, man. Alright, so they had to improve the post game to pretty much um exaggerate being skilled in the post. And because yo, 2K17, I ain't gonna front, man. 2K17 failed. It failed when it comes to post play. Because all you had to do to dominate the game in 2K17 was hit fadeaways and do hook shots that's it you see these fadeaways and hook shots unstoppable especially if you're a post scorer or a glass cleaner man yo i was beasted with my glass cleaner don't even let me get my post scorer man i was just hitting fadeaways all day you couldn't do nothing you couldn't tell me nothing i don't care what defense you play double team triple team wouldn't matter man so hopefully they make it more about skill timing um because basketball is like a chess game man it's like a chess game now i'm going to emphasize on that a little bit more after i talk about the last thing he highlighted right he said shot fakes up and under redone right once you fake you have five directions to choose from to shoot after fake and you can chain so you could actually chain it he says it's very useful right so you could chain the moves you could pump pick and do a um do a step and a spin move or something because it seemed like you could link these moves man then this is what um i was talking about in terms of basketball being like chess because i play chess man i play chess and the reason why i've been so good in basketball over these years right is not by being i was one of the most um athletic but not by using my athleticism all the time right i would pretty much look up know my opponent and it would be a chess game it would just be a chess game it would be me anticipating me trying to be a few moves ahead you know what i mean me trying to basically outthink him 
right and that's basketball it's all about using your head more than your physical don't get carried away man don't get carried away with being the fastest the quickest hell no why do you think lebron gotta study the game so much why i think they gotta study tape why do you think i have to before every college game the day before we would have to have a booklet a booklet of plays the um our opponent's strengths and weaknesses so we would know if he constantly goes right if he constantly goes left if he got a fake first before he shoots if he got a dribble to the left before he shoots if he's stronger shooting from the he, like he got so many different dynamics to this game that they could eventually get there but i like this so far so hopefully that's the direction they're going in man i know i'm talking a lot but you know your boy gotta keep you all updated man so let me know what y'all think in the comments your boy sim you know i got y'all with the news man you all know i got y'all with the updates man if you're first time to my channel make sure to like the video share the video hit your boy a subscribe if it's not your first time like the video share the video you never know who's gonna be informed man your boy sim one love respect <laughs> bless up Clutch, throw it up, that's game I'm going through the lane Russell Westbrook quickness yep. Kyrie be crossing them Leaving defenders shifting Woo. It's funny cause they slipping Slip. Me, I'm never missing You can pick the heat, dog. I beat you with the Pistons ah. Listen, comprehend this and pay attention Brutal Sims like LeBron No one can defend